Budding artist from Winter Harbor was honored at the State House today. Brittany McHatton paints us a picture from Augusta. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Warren Hardin's latest creation, an acrylic portrait of Joshua Chamberlain, arrived at its new home in the State House Wednesday. Where you'll see that there's bare canvas on the painting. And a lot of the paintings we're looking at from that era, artists wouldn't even finish the paintings. They'd paint the, the face and they paint some of the clothing and then the rest would almost just be like a pencil sketch or just bare canvas. So I kind of wanted to go that route and like make it more authentic that way where I was creating something similar to that era rather than just a regular portrait you see today. Hardin State Representative Billy Bob Fockingham requested he make the piece that will hang in the Republican offices. I got a whole wide open wall right there that we're going to put it up. This was the minority leader's first time seeing any part of the work. I'm just blown away. It really does give me goosebumps to see, um, see Joshua Chamberlain come to life like that. Uh, I just look at it and it gives me images of what he must have been like. And I get to hang this portrait on, you know, on the House Republican wall. It's just an honor. Hardin says he's been working on it since just after Christmas, and it took him about 30 hours to finish in all. He put the finishing touches on it just hours before the big reveal. The final brush stroke was actually made yesterday, and I, the frame was already on it. Hardin was able to see the official portrait of Chamberlain that hangs in the Senate room. He says knowing his work will grace the walls of the same building is a dream come true. Oh my word, it's everything. It's, it's really a, truly an honor to be in here. It, anywhere in this building would be an honor. And um, yeah, it, I, it, it's, it's hard to wrap my mind around. I'm still just kind of in awe of all the ports that I just saw in there. So I'm kind of tongue tied here, but it's, it's, it's truly an honor, truly an honor to be in here. Brittany McCatton, WABI TV 5 News, Augusta.